it does look like the entire camp is cleared out. It does look like that is in fact the case. No room. So okay, we can go. We can go, and we can clear out the rest of the camp. Oh, hi. There and watches it. Somebody needs a killing, and I'm gonna give it. <laughs> Somebody needs a killing. Somebody needs a killing. Ain't that right, Paul? that away uh supply crates where's see anybody else i assume it's going to be like a boss fight where he's going to come out and like a cutscene and be like well 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 what do we have here Not too much already Or there's just nobody here. That works too. It is a cutscene. Okay. Smells peaceful. I hate peace. A lot of people die peacefully. Not me. I got a feeling. Search the camp. Could any of you find a charcoal pile in a flat field? I don't think so. There we go. could also do is uh one of these come on in come on in you know what come on over how do you see me oh hold on hold on Wait. i almost died again I didn't though. Didn't happen. Ooh. I'm gonna shatter you. Are you? Here, hi, leader. Oh, damn it. Hey, Lloyd, now it's no longer the time for sneaking, just, just, just run. Sending you something. More 
How about that? Fake Keyless. Although I have to say, upon further reflection about the Helis fight, it was a little bit disappointing. And I'll tell you why. Because I wanted, like, an actual fight. And not just, like, a, you know, go around and, and destroy the explosives while he's right next to them fight. A uh, gimmick fight. I wanted a real, a real fight with uh, Helis. Asarom's fire weapon. Could come in handy. No. Oh. Don't let me get the loot then. You. Won't be long before the Werak finds out I took out the bandit camp. In fact, I'll bet my name's all over Song's Edge. Might be time to challenge Aratok. Nah, not yet. Not yet. Hey, like, oh, I can buy it. What do I want this striker bow? I do use the striker bow more than the other bow. I can buy this forge fire. Sure, the can I not talking, just take one? But send them to the cut, and most of them don't last a week. Apparently not. Apparently, all the loot is gone. Unless I do, or do you already have one? Do I already have one? No, I'm going to buy it. That's fine. I can buy it. I got I got the money for it. I got the money. I got the uh the thing, it's the heart. A good camp. Worthy of the work you've done to secure it for us. So we'll just buy it. Forge fire. I'm not going to equip it right now. Oh, did I buy? Did I get a box from the bandit guy? God damn it, game! Stop giving me boxes! For fuck's sake! So I didn't have to buy it, but you know what? I mean, it's not like I'm lacking in in stuff. I guess I can sell him one of my forge fires. It's not like I'm lacking in stuff. Like it doesn't really matter that much. Just, just give me the weapon. Don't give me a... Like, why... Why give me a loot box with a weapon in it when they could have just given me the weapon? Why? How much is this? 16. I need four more blue gleam. I'm going to save up for that. Uh, I can... Shove a fire on here. Fire and handling would be good. I guess this works. Don't need the shock, but this doesn't matter. You say Meridian is a place where every need is met. Alright. We can go get this, and then we will uh, continue on our merry way and get these blue gleams and this pigment. Oh. Maybe I don't want to do that. <laughs> Don't want to take that shortcut. Maybe not. If I blink, my eyes will freeze shut. They might, Aloy. They might indeed. We run into each other again. If I didn't know any better, I'd think you were following me. Are you talking to me? I'm not following you, lady. I don't give a shit about you. A little bit steep. Ah. Hmm. Well fortified. Hmm. Good hunting. Tolerable company. I think they might like the place. Uh, do I want to sell anything right now?
I mean, the answer is yes, I am. I am selling things. Obviously. But also, I wanted to buy some potions. I actually need some wire. Oddly enough. We'll go ahead and go up to 200. Because I use wire like crazy. away, I guess. Time for more collecting! Hey! I'm glad that Roach 4.0 populates this area. I'd much rather have Roach 4.0 than anybody else. Mounts are a little bit problematic in this game, I do admit. It's nothing. I thought that was definitely a thing, but it's nothing. But I did find the climby area. I thought that was like a little hidden cave or something. That would have been kind of cool. Off this one. one down, and then there's another one up here. We'll stay up here for now. here at some point, but what I want to do is go this way. Get the gleam. I'm going to assume that because the icon is down, the blue gleam is down. I mean, that would be mostly correct. This blue this gleam will make some shaman happy. I need just two more. Just two more. That's all I need. Whee! Oh, there's lore here. Oh, shit. There was lore up there. Oh, Can I get back up there from here? I might be able to. I might be able to cheese it. Yes. Lafayette's Last Supper. Look, honey, we're front page. The Dubois Wrangler. Local family serves up last farm-grown steak to Governor Jebson. June 11, 2038. Wyoming Governor Mr. Ozzie Jebson. 
was in the Dubois area last week for some official visits in the uh, in among the business of those the busyness of those appointments. He sat down for a very special dinner with a very special family, the Lafayettes. Everyone knows the Lafayettes, of course, who hasn't ridden one of their trails astride a sturdy paint pony, played chase the gopher in their fields or chowed down on a thick, juicy steak coming off their farm. Their solid gold reputation is what brought the governor to their table two nights ago. It's no secret that raising cattle has gotten ever more difficult and expensive. A long time past are the days of herds stretching to the horizon. Why, nearly the only people who still keep cows are dude ranchers. Dude! The Lafayettes tried their best, God bless them. But they were smart enough to see what's coming down the country lane and banished their, far or their barns in favor of shiny new meat growing operation a few months back. This impressive collection of vats, tubes, and belts takes up almost an acre of land and allows production of over 600 meat units per day that corrupted. See, I wonder... <laughs> Could have been bad. I wonder if this fire break thing hap has something to do with the... Um... Ouch the whole the, the environmental crisis because that was the crisis just before the that was the crisis just before the 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 whole uh, uh the robot thing so i wonder if that's it But that still doesn't like necessarily answer the question of what specifically is it. Uh, I'm going to go down this way and we're going to get these two uh, pigments and this blue gleam. Uh, I might go over here. I might do this. Let's go here and then we'll we'll get the figurine, we'll do this, we'll do this, and then we'll kind of go south. And that might end up being it for, uh, for today. I have a question for everybody. And if you're watching this on YouTube, you can also put it in the comments. Ranch Doritos or Nacho Cheese Doritos? What's your preference? If you had to pick one, if you had to pick only one and the other one would be wiped off the face of the earth. Which one would you pick? Nacho cheese, says Giant Nerd Guy. You know, I think I I think I probably agree with that. No, I think I think uh, I think that's a that's a decent one, giant nerd guy. I think that I would much you rather have nacho cheese. Hey, she's starting without us. Let's get down there, flaming skulls. Oh, you guys are here. Okay, I was gonna. Okay. Not our name. Maybe we should table this argument until after the hunt. You know, we're just gonna go do this. I see that. Don't think that I don't see that. But at the same time, I'd rather get this first. I'm 
much better. Okay. Hey guys. Yep. I thought that was just a warning signal. I'll bring you down. Let's get this out. Get out of the way. I'd rather they don't shoot. I hate when they shoot. People think I'm weird, and for very many reasons. But people think I'm weird for, um, eating Doritos and chocolate milk. I don't dip them or anything. That would be weird. But I will have some nacho cheese Doritos, specifically nacho cheese. It does not work with Cool Ranch or any other flavor. Nacho cheese. Just just eat some nacho cheese Doritos, and then have a nice a nice like the hut. gulp of, of chocolate milk. Did you find the next part? There's something about there's something about it that 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 like the flavors go well together. I don't know for me. If you have if you at home are watching this and have some nacho cheese Doritos and some chocolate milk. Uh, it's not healthy at all. I would not do it as a regular thing. But uh, but it's good. That's another part down. One more and you'll have what you need to pay off Burgrind. Starting to feel real, you know. I'm starting to believe we're really going to get out of here. Honestly, I wasn't sure we'd survive a week without Nakoni. But here we are. Who's Nakoni? Shaman. Nakoni. Nakoni was. She, she was a friend of ours. She challenged the chieftain for control of our. Of the Werak. She didn't make it. No. If you're gonna tell this story, tell it true. She was murdered. Uh, how? Is this why you left Banor? Because of this business with Nakoni and your chieftain? Onaka knew Nakoni was our mentor, our friend. We couldn't stay. That final night, we snuck back to camp, packed what we could, and left. Like cowards. What are we to tie? We are Banuk, aren't we? Survive and prevail. That's what we do. It's not what she did. Well, I mean, not everyone can be a survivor. Say not, not everyone can win. Nakoni challenged the chieftain. Why? Someone's got to lose. Nakoni wrapped himself in power and authority the way some people wrap themselves in furs. If you're willing to fawn over him and sing false songs to him, you might get a spot on the best hunts. The Werex split into two. Those willing to lick the bottoms of Oniku's feet, and the rest of us, waiting for things to get better. Until Nikoni. She was the best and bravest of us. She was the one who took a stand. What happened? What I think you? it's pretty obvious. It she challenged the chief into a hunting competition. Oniku, damn him! He wasn't nearly the hunter Nikoni was. But who comes back to the camp after the trial? Oniku, grinning like a snap maw, crowing. Oh, where's little Nukoni? We tracked Nukoni through the woods. Found her not far from the trailhead. But their damn neck snapped. I don't want to remember her like that. But sometimes that memory... It's all I can think of. I'm sorry to die. It sounds like she meant a lot to you. To all of you. Alright. I'm sorry for what you've been through. It's nice to be heard. Thank you, Aloy. Look, it doesn't matter, okay? What happened in Bonor is buried in Bonor. What matters now what happens is what in happens Vegas. in the Sundom. Stays in That's Vegas. That's where the burning turkeys are going to make a name for ourselves, the burning right? turkeys. Oh, the burning turkeys? Seriously? It rolls off the tongue. Sort of like vomit? 
So, where to next? There's a lake just west of here. Seems like a good place to find a snap mall thing. We'll meet you there. Okay. If you beat us there, just wait by the campfire. We'll be along. Okay. I'm I'm not going to do that, but I mean I I will eventually, but not not right now cuz it's not on the way. It is actually kind of vaguely on the way, but pigment I feel like, oddly enough, I feel like having some Doritos and chocolate milk now. I would also take some slightly burnt turkey. Not like super burnt, hopefully. A little bit burnt is okay. Think of summer sun. Breeze through the trees. Wow, I have almost all of the pigments already. <laughs> so, uh, yellow. They're all, like, exactly the same. I'm not sure that this is how crystals work. It's like good. Yellow. Uh, kind of an orangey. Red. Green. Blue. Don't know what this one is yet. Uh, another kind of green. Another kind of blue. Uh... Burning turkeys could be a bad metal band. If someone has the metal band name of Burning Turkeys, let me know. And, um... I will decide if your band is worthy of the name. Yeah, Dark Salt is what I have when the foliage gets in the way. You're 100% correct about that. Dark Salt is also what I have when I can't find the blue gleam that's literally 10 feet away from me. Blue gleam. I'll be taking that. All right, I have enough of the thing. I'm not going to go right there. I'm going to go get uh, get this pigment. It looks like I'm going to want to go this way because it looks like there's a path here and then there's going to be like a lot of climbing. So I'm going to want to go like yeah, this way around here to that path and then probably do a lot of climbing as I just literally just got done saying don't know why I'm repeating myself now Okay, so these will keep. Where to climbing at? I am at the right place, aren't I? Yes, I think that I am. Am I going up or am I going over? It looks like I'm going over. Am I going that way? I feel like I don't really want to go that way. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I do want to go up here. No. All right. <laughs> Aloy. God damn it. God damn it, Aloy. <laughs> I have to cheese my way back up here. did it. Uh, where am I going? I have to get kind of back up and I guess I want to go here. Okay. 
I can get back up here. It's fine. The cheese is strong with this one. And if not, I can always just go around here because I think I'm, I'm pretty sure I can just go right this way. No, I can't. Kaboom. Cheesed. Well, I thought I saw a straightforward path up there on the map. Then it turns out I, in fact, did not. I don't think I need to go up here, do you? This isn't even the right map. I mean, there is, there was a, a line going there, though, wasn't there? <laughs> get myself killed, aren't I? I'm gonna like slip off an edge, <laughs> a ledge, one of these, one of these times. No, there's no way. There's no way it's from here. There's no way. for being careful I'm careful you haven't died to falling in a while in a long while Aloy ah ah I see climbing things uh. So, I got dropped down there, but I don't know why I want to do that. <laughs> ah, this must be it. All right, I'm on. I'm on my way. It's happening. The climbing is real. Need to drop to the ledge? There we go. Can I get up? I can't get up. No, this is much faster. My gasp uh, had me swallow, like, a bit of spit. <coughs> that was a bad time to gasp. This is like the um, going for the uh, for the banner uh, statues in the in the main game. I enjoy this. I enjoy the climbing. Since we haven't done it for a while. First of all, time of day. I wish I could change the weather. Let's make it like, uh, like late afternoon. Get a little bit of color in this. This would be, yeah, it's like evening. Oh, that look, that's that's nice. Okay, I'll I'll do that. Uh, green down there we go. <laughs> I 
No. I might have her looking over there, actually. Close photo mode. Close this. Let's have her looking this way. Have her looking. There we go, this way. Yeah. We will uh, also make it a bit earlier. I mean, actually, nighttime could look cool with the volcano. Oh, yeah. That actually looks really cool. You know what? We're going to make it midnight. Uh, body pose. That body pose is actually not bad, but we'll see what else we got. A lot of sitting poses. <laughs> kind of like that one, but I don't know if we're going to use that one. You know, we're going to go with none. I like this. I like this pose. I like this pose a lot. Zoom out. Now we're going to zoom in a little bit. You can hear my PS4 like working overtime. Can I like roll it a little bit? It's not bad. Oh, nah. We don't need that to field. Don't know if we need brightness adjusting at all. Exposure, like gamma intensity. That's kind of cool. Vibrant looks okay. Summer. That looks kind of cool. That looks okay. Eh. What do you think? This one? Can maybe put the exposure up a little bit? Border? Vignette? There we go. Take a picture. This is it. Do we want to use a different uh, border? Oh, that looks kind of cool. You know what? Shit, this looks this looks kind of cool. I'll take this one too. Let's resume. Oh, we're on the other side of the dam. On the other side of the goddamn. Uh, I think that this is gonna be it. Let me make my way down to this, uh... To this thing here. Hopefully there's like a nice, easy repel point around here, because... <laughs> Otherwise, it's going to take me, like, five years to get down. Oh, okay. I was so paranoid about that not working. <laughs> making my way down at this point. Where am I going? I'd like to go down. Ah. 
Is it ledge? There we go. This might work. Or it might be very far down. Let's see if this kills me. <laughs> what is the purpose of this? I did it. It happened. I saw that loot. I don't care. So, uh, this is going to be the last Horizon Zero Dawn until after October. Um, where's this place? We'll find out later. Next week is October, and I'm going to be doing spoopy games for Spooptober. And, uh, so that's going to happen all month. So people watching on YouTube, uh, this will be the last Horizon Zero Dawn uh, video for a month. I am going to come back right after that's done, right uh, at the beginning of November. It is, it is coming right back. I'm not going to, like... It's not going to be one of those things where it's like, oh yeah, I'll play this game again, and then like I never play it again. Oh, winters coming at once. Um, I am definitely going to continue playing this game in November. So just let you know, it is coming back. It's going to disappear for a month, but it is coming back. So thanks everybody for watching, and uh, and we will be back with Aloy. It also it also does mean I'll be garbage at, at Horizon Zero Dawn when, when we get back. Uh, we'll be back with Aloy in a month, in about a month's time. So, goodbye!